You've heard it before. Zone two isn't just walking. It's too easy to make a difference. Real gains come from HIIT workouts or lifting heavy. But here's the truth. Zone two is where the deepest adaptations happen, especially at the cellular level. And no one trains it. Let's break down the myths. Myth number one, zone two is a waste of time because it's too slow and doesn't burn enough calories. Wrong. Zone two bursts mitochondrial biogenesis by 20 to 30% helping your body build more power plants and turn food and oxygen into usable energy, allowing you to recover faster. More mitochondria means better fat burning, more endurance, faster recovery, and less fatigue, even outside of workouts. Myth number two, HIIT training is better for fat loss. Not exactly. HIIT spikes cortisol, which can lead to water retention, poor recovery, and even reduced mitochondrial function when they're overused. Zone two, on the other hand, improves insulin sensitivity and supports fat oxidation without triggering fight or flight. Myth number three, zone two is only for beginners. Nonsense. That's like saying deep breathing is only for yogis. Elite endurance athletes do hours of zone two training every week, not because it's easy, but because it builds a powerful base. Without it, you plateau, you burn out, you stall. In a 2025 Journal of Applied Physiology study, athletes who added just three zone two sessions a week improved mitochondrial density more than those doing HIT alone. And a meta-analysis that same year found that zone two cut overtraining risk by 40%, thanks to a better nervous system recovery and lower systemic inflammation. That's the power of zone two and mitochondrial training. Zone two isn't lazy, it's layered. It signals your body to adapt steadily instead of crash cycling between extremes. Want to build strength? Zone two supports muscle protein synthesis by restoring ATP faster and clearing the lactate. Want to lose fat? Zone two trains your metabolism to burn fat at rest, not just during workouts. Want brain clarity, better sleep? Zone two boosts BDNF and lowers nighttime cortisol. Zone two is the foundation every high performer needs, but few understand and almost nobody use because they're so caught up in trying to burn calories. Swap one hit session this week for a 40 minute zone two walk or cycle and start to train your mitochondria. Use the talk test. If you can speak in full sentences and breathe through your nose, you're in the zone and you are now training mitochondria how to respond and adapt. Track how you feel, not just physically, but mentally. Notice the recovery, the clarity, the calm power. That's zone two because when you send the right signals, your body responds. Zone two isn't about doing less, it's about doing what actually works. That's it for today, but this journey doesn't stop here. Hit subscribe, tap the bell, and I'll meet you in the next one.